This video will explain four-wire Kelvin measurements as related to cable testing. Automatic cable testers, like ohm meters, measure resistance in a wire by forcing current through it and measuring the voltage that develops. With normal two-wire testing, called that because one wire goes to each side of the wire being measured, the resistance of the test fixture, or meter leads, is included. With four-wire or Kelvin testing, two wires go to each side of the wire being measured. One is the current force wire, the other voltage measure or sense wire. In this case, no current flows through the voltmeter or sense leads, so you get a true resistance measurement from the point where the force and sense leads come together. This effectively eliminates the resistance of your interface wires, allowing you to measure only the value of the wire being tested. Also, four-wire testing is done with higher current or voltage amplifiers to make more precise measurements so you can accurately measure resistances in the milliohm range. Although four-wire testing does allow for a high degree of accuracy, there are some limitations. Actual resistance measurements take place after the point where the force and sense wires come together. So a four-wire fixture that uses a mating connector will still include the resistance of the mating pins, usually 10 to 100 milliohms. And as the pins wear out with continued use, this contact resistance will increase and become more variable. Likewise, four-wire fixtures that use spring probes will include the resistance between the plunger and barrel, and any resistance between the probe tip and contact. This problem can be eliminated if you can bring two spring probes to the contact point of the device under test, although this is often not possible due to space constraints. For more detailed information on four-wire Kelvin testing, visit our website at cirrus.com and type four-wire testing into the search box. Or call 1-800-441-9910 to speak directly to one of our trained customer service technicians.